All right, guys, welcome back. It's been a while, hasn't it? But today I'm super, super excited because I'm finally getting something that I've been dying to get for almost four years now. I'm finally starting to work on my sleeve. And if you guys don't know already, I got a small tattoo right here. Um, that was three years ago, right? And that was kind of just like a test. And after that, I didn't really get any tattoos, which was kind of weird because I really wanted to, but my mom, you know how brown moms are. Like, they're always so worried about you. My dad actually doesn't mind if I get one, but finally today's the day i booked the appointment and i'm about to go there right now so i thought it would be really nice if i document it and i take you guys with me if you guys are new to the channel welcome this is my channel if you guys enjoyed the content make sure you hit the like button and subscribe that's the most important thing it makes me realize that i'm actually doing something and you guys enjoy it um but let's get right into this man i'm super super excited let's do this Okay, so there is a few things that you'd be surprised that you might need, and a few things that you probably don't really care about. Um, number one, of course, bring your phone, sense of entertainment. You need entertainment, especially when you're doing a super long ass tattoo. It can get really boring just looking at your skin, so just keeping yourself entertained is a better experience overall. Um, of course, some earbuds, um, just listen to some music, you know, get the time over with. The most important thing that I got to tell you guys, and this is something I've learned because I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos as well. Water is super crucial because if you don't keep your skin hydrated, the tattoo isn't going to be as good as you think. And you might have dry skin and things, that, which might ruin the tattoo as well. So make sure you bring water. Make sure you drink a lot of water before. And honestly, I'm super excited to go. I think I got everything I need to get. And of course, don't forget your money as always. Um, but man... I can't believe the day's already here, so I'm about to head over there. Wave. I'm in it for keepsake, in a field with the cleat lace. Beat freak with the bare face and a slick tie, that's what she say. She left good, she a big tease, and she bite me with the big face. Hella bad, but she throwing it back, she bring out my way for the team play. For Pete's sake, I'm above average, I padded my stack. I got a matter what he say. I'm the 2010, got LeBron James off the backboard, type of bad boy. Hold it down for the task force, if I run his face, then you ask for it. Cross need to laugh more. I keep it a hundred on dashboard. The live show need a passport. Cause the beat bounced to the cap on. Feel like I live it fast forward, but I asked for it. This fit got a quick lit on a crash course from the tatter garment to the tabloid. Spoke how I live it into existence. Might be ahead of myself, but the bank account did jump up a couple figures. But like nobody could fuck with us. I'm a flight risk. I play among the stars in a Hollywood hill. The space that you couldn't even get in touch with me. Praise faith that I stuck with it. Wave. No, I really can't complain. Everything is straight. Everything I say turn into the real thing. I tell her on the air, cause you know it ain't a thing. We made it up the slums, the words on the page. Everything is straight, I've been on the wave. But everything I say turn into the real thing. I've been living like I'm famous. Like I don't show my face, I see jumping on the stage. Like I'm living in a daydream. Lost in imagination. She only want me when she fades. She couldn't tell me I'm a fake. Currently, the next day, the next morning, I was super, super tired right after the tattoo. I literally, like, I came back home and I just was on bed the whole day. But anyways, the next day, just took a shower, cleaned up the whole tattoo, give it a little bit of moisturizing cream. Um, but man, I'm really, really happy with the way it came out. It's like perfect, like the way I wanted it right now, still in the healing process. So this isn't exactly how it's going to look like at the end. It's going to start like kinda cleaning up in the skin and everything. But overall i'm super happy and also if danny you're watching this man thank you so much man you were super super supportive and like usually tattoo artists sometimes i'm not gonna lie i've been with a few they're really like bitchy but not overall experience i really had a fun time you can put on movies for me like the whole experience was really good like pain wise out of 10 i'd probably say for me it was around 7 to 7.5 reason being is because i have really sensitive skin so like even right now it's stinging a little bit but not too bad but it's healing up pretty well so far. And Danny, if you're watching this, man, I want you to do my whole arm. I can't wait for the next session. I'm not too sure when it's going to be, but I'll keep you updated. Once again, guys, if you're looking to get any information, if you guys are looking to get any information on my tattoo artist that I got it from, I'll leave everything in the link in the description below. 
Um, you can feel free to check out the Instagram of Bodyworks Tattoo. That's the place I went. Danny's the guy I got it from. I'll leave everything in the description if you guys want to know more about them. Um, but overall, really, really happy with them, man. And once again, Danny, thank you so much. All right, guys. So the last thing I kind of want to end this off on, um, this is the number one reason why people are getting tattoos. And it's that when you're getting a tattoo like this or any tattoo in general, you're signing yourself up for judgment, right? At the end of the day, there's gonna be people who love this type of but there's gonna be some people that won't like it and are gonna judge you and are gonna tell you that it was a stupid decision. But when you sign up that waiver, when you sign up that letter, when you pay for that tattoo, when you get it, you're signing yourself up for judgment. Just know that, right? If you're not, if you think you're not gonna be able to handle that from whether it be from friends, family, or anybody close, don't get a tattoo because you're not ready right this is something that you should be doing for yourself and only for yourself unless it has a meaning for somebody else but at the end of the day nobody else should matter whether you get it or not it's just you but that's gonna be the end of the video guys hopefully you guys liked it i tried to keep it as short simple and sweet as possible um try to keep it less than seven minutes so that you guys can enjoy it as much as possible but that's gonna be the end of video man let me know what you guys think of the tattoo make sure you subscribe to the channel for more videos and i'll see you guys next time i love you guys peace